Alright guys, Simon here, we're playing Mass Effect 3, and let's go cure the Genophage, yes! Uh, I think all the side quests that we can do have been done, you know, that we can do right now. So this is a plot critical mission, you have to cure the Genophage. Well, you know, technically cure the Genophage. Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're going to be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, ma'am. New form of Reaper, Shepard. Using Shroud to poison Tuchaka's atmosphere. Problematic. They want to fight! They just got one. Primarch, we're going to need your help. That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. We're doing this for Palavin. No one said it would be easy. What do you have in mind? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Rex, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud facility. Finish synthesizing cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. Okay, <laughs> that was fast. He just formulated that plan right on the spot. So there's a there's one Reaper on the chunk. I don't know why they would do that. I mean, it's the Krogan. They sent one Reaper to take care of all the Krogan. I know the Krogan nuked their own planet, and they're you know, they've been demilitarized for a thousand years or so, but they're still pretty formidable. Really, one Reaper against the Krogan? We've never faced a Reaper up close like this. Everyone on board? There's even a doubt? Let's move, Pijak. It's time to cure the Genophage. Commander, incoming message marked urgent. I'll put it in the comm room for you. Right. Dalatras. Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. And by now, I imagine Morden Solus has proposed using the Shroud. Are you spying on us? Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow your misguided sympathy for the Krogan to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the Genophage will end in lasting peace? No, it will end with the Krogan fighting the Reapers. You can't let the past cloud your judgment about the fact that the Reapers are going to attack your planet pretty soon, Delatras. These people, man. We have to give the Krogan that chance. We can't condemn an entire race to extinction based on what might happen. What will happen is the Krogan will reproduce out of control. We uplifted them specifically for their violent nature, not their diplomatic skills. Another war is inevitable. What do you want, Delatras? Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Rex believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible, and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. Right. So, Salarian fleets... or Krogans? Salarian fleets or Krogans? I'm pretty sure I want Krogans against the Reapers. I don't know what fleets you Salarians think you have, but I want Krogans against the Reapers. Ah, this person. Another war is inevitable? You're already at war! You're already at war with the Reapers! Like, why would you worry about the, the war after the one that you can't beat right now? It's crazy.
Um, don't need to change anything. I'm pretty sure. All right, let's not change anything. Um, no points. All right. So now we are seriously going to Tachanka. I've ordered the clans to assemble at the Hollows. It's our sacred meeting ground. We'll land there and take an armored convoy against the Reaper. This will be the defining moment of Krogan history. Krogan history filled with defining moments, most bloody. Hope this one better. Commander, you seem troubled. I got a message from them. <sighs> Rex, it's Reap. The Reapers are already at the Hollows. Come out with guns blazing. Hang on tight. We're heading in. So you get to decide whether you tell them about what the Delatra said. Found! Shepard! Keep them away from the female! I'll sort out what's happening with the other clans! Ha! <laughs> Punched. Everyone pick your targets and keep an eye on our six. Now move! Alright, so we just need to defend the Eve, which is pretty easy. Let's just throw down a singularity right there. And then, um, oh look, slam them right there. Fun times. Oh look, he's running into the singularity. Interesting. He's dead. So, is anyone else who wants to fight me? Oh, really? Really husks. Uh, did I actually hit him? I didn't hit him, did I? Alright, let's, let's throw down more singularities. Come on, Liara, stop wasting. Okay, never mind. What's going on out here? Um, sure, I just do that, just for the fun of it. And I might as well shoot him from a distance. Or oh, those guys. They'll sing battle songs about this someday. Reaper blood has finally soaked our soil. <laughs> We have to get to the Shroud. The airstrike is on its way. Female safe, Shepard. Vitals are strong. What's a Solarian doing here? Nobody said anything about this. Multiple Krogan. Problematic. Who are you? Erd not Reed, brood brother to our illustrious leader. <laughs> Reeve and I share the same mother and nothing else. For which I'm thankful. I remember what it means to be a true Krogan. <laughs> we flay our enemies alive and drown them in a geyser of their own blood. We don't invite them into our home. Your Reaper, I mean your Reaper is, is the Reaper is the enemy. Not the uh, not the Silverian here. If you can flay that Reaper alive, I'll give you bonus points, Reeve. This Solarian is not your enemy. He's here to help cure the genophage. His kind gave us the genophage. Why should we trust him? Oh. Oh. Because I do. And so will you. Enough! You can stay here and let old wounds fester as Krogan have always done. Or you can fight the enemy you were born to destroy and win a new future for our children. I choose to fight. Who will join me? I will. And so will I. Now hold your heads high like true Krogan. There's a Reaper that needs killing! <laughs> I'm 
I'm not sure what happens if you did the uh, earlier games differently. Obviously we did the best we could for Rex, like he's the leader of Clan Erdnaught and now he's the leader of all Krogan. Reed isn't the only Krogan who wants revenge for the Genophage, Rex. You'll have to placate them somehow. I'll demand the Council return some of our old territory. We'll need room to expand. Recapture the glory of the Ancients. Glory of Ancients led to Krogan Rebellion. Countless deaths. Creation of Genophage. Expansion plan problematic. What were the Ancient Krogan like? Tachanka wasn't always a wasteland. In the old times, the Krogan were a proud people. We had dreams, a future to look forward to. Until Salarian interfered. No, we destroyed Tachunga ourselves. Technology changed us. It made life too easy. So we looked for new challenges and found them in each other. Nuclear war was inevitable. But now our planet is rubble. We'll need a better place to live. See, they still avoid the, the problem of the population problem. They'll need some form of population control. I mean, Eve was saying it there. Technology made their lives too easy. They need some other way to keep their numbers in check. But they just avoid that issue. I mean, the genophage is one way to keep the numbers in check. But the problem, like Okia said, I, I think it was Okia, or maybe it was Rex, like the only trait the genophage selects for is surviving the genophage. It doesn't produce strong Krogan, it doesn't produce uh, intelligent Krogan, it doesn't even produce peaceful Krogan, it just kind of produces Krogan that can survive the genophage. So that's not a good way to, you know, select who gets to live. I mean, the idea of, you know, natural selection or, you know, even unnatural selection is you want to, you want, you know, thing, you want favorable traits to survive. So if you if you want intelligent intelligent Krogan then however it is that you choose to cull your numbers, you should select for the most intelligent runs, right? Or if you want strong Krogan then you want some sort of contest of strength to decide who gets to live. And so you kinda cull off the weaker ones. So anyway, I'm getting off track, aren't I? Yeah they they, they don't talk about birth control at all. It doesn't have to be birth control, as I said, it can be some sort of rite of passage that kills, you know, 99.9% .9 of the Krogan that try it, and then only one out of every thousand actually make it out alive. I mean, that's pretty brutal, right? But given their birth rate, maybe that's appropriate. I'd say helping defeat the Reapers would be worth a new planet. Or ten. You haven't seen how fast we can pop them out. Rex. What? With the Genophage cured, we'll have a lot of catching up to do. Commander, on the shuttle, was there something you were going to say? The Dalatras tried to cut a secret deal with me. What kind of deal? She said they sabotaged the Shroud years ago. The cure won't work unless we fix it. Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. And she thought we wouldn't know better? Correctly. Would likely have fooled tests, but familiar with STG work, can adjust. Did not come this far for nothing. You just spared our race another genocide, Commander. I told you we could count on her. Why are we stopping? That's a shroud. Rex, you and Morden stay with Eve. It's looking ugly out here. That's the shroud, but uh, it's not supposed to be doing that. That's the reaper poisoning. Oh, that's a reaper right there. So the smaller reapers are less like cuttlefish, which is a real shame because I like the uh, the cuttlefish. They should have made them more like cuttlefish, I think. Although then they would be visually too similar to the big ones, I guess. 
All right, so there's a shroud. Um, I think there's loot around here. Let me just look around a little bit. Uh, what's happening is I just leveled up. Alright. Yoink. Um, the Growl Spike Thrower has a bit of fire rate, slightly less damage but more accurate. I'm gonna change to this one. So instead of normal shotgun, it uh, oversized flechettes, uh, pierce thresher hide and create a deep wound. A deep, deep wound channel is leading to massive blood loss. Double barreled. Huh. Its shots can be charged for more damage. That sounds awesome. Alright, so I'm going to change to that thing. Although I'm not going to keep that neither. Remember to bring it back when you're done, human. Um, I'm going to keep it, if you don't mind. Because you're going to die pretty soon. Um, I'm looking at the scenery, Liara. Man, they nuked their entire planet. Yeah, birth control, and, and that was because of the population explosion. I mean, technology allowed all their young to survive, whereas before they would get eaten by threshing balls and whatnot. Oh, look, there's some more stuff. Wow, there's like, wow, there's like six things out here. It's like Christmas. Well, hit it then. Go for it. Go for it. This combustion manifold isn't going to last long. Let's get moving. <laughs> combustion manifold. Also, wouldn't these things take a lot of fuel to run? Well, these are like massive tanks. What do they run on? Ezo? Never mind, let's just talk to him. What's the hold up? Roads out. The convoy can't make it through. Turian Wing Artemek, this is Shepard. We've been delayed. Hold off your attack. Negative Commander, our approach is locked. The Reaper already knows we're here. Um, that's not gonna work. An airstrike isn't enough against the Reaper. We must join the fight! Damn it! I don't care if we have to build a new road. We are going! Shepard! Well, he's boned. Of all the places you can crash, you have to crash into us. Strike did absolutely nothing, and then all the tanks are destroyed too. Well, this is going well. These guys. Well, I guess I get to keep your shotgun then, don't I? Hey, eh? because you're dead. Ah, your your friend's dead too. So your other friends. So much for the combustion manifold, huh? 